what those dishes are. Thank you for bringing all of these today. Absolutely. We, it looks like us. we got three meals and then a little dessert, <laughs> funky dessert. It looks really, it's <laughs> a, a good looking dessert. That's <laughs> our s'mores cheesecake. S'mores, okay, I was wondering yeah. if it would be s'mores. The marshmallows kind of give it away. What else do we have here? Absolutely, we have our gokshujang pork belly bites. Nice little appetizer for you. A shorty French dip, that's our short rib French dip. Oh my goodness. Uh, we cook that over five hours. Make sure it's all ready, nice to be plated. And our putanesca, it's a traditional spaghetti dish. Putanesca? Wow. Yes. What does that, does that mean anything? <laughs> uh, traditionally it translates to mean prostitute, because it was invented in brothels, oh. traditionally. Wow, <laughs> Maddie. A hearty meal, whoops. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, let's just start with the pork belly. That's the photo yeah, that I keep one. seeing on Facebook. And why did you bring this item to your menu? We brought this one because we were looking for something that was a little more spicy. Something to <laughs> kick up our appetizers. Uh, originally, we did not have anything as spicy like that. We used to have our a, a gyoza oh. back when we first opened. But now we have our pork belly bites featuring gashujang sauce. It's salt brined overnight and then oven roasted for four hours before we get them into these little bites for you. Wow. wow. And so if people wanted a spicier option and also a savior, this savory, savory. <laughs> yes. then that would be the item to go to. It's Absolutely. An appetizer. Okay, Jackson, Absolutely. you like spicy food? Yeah. I, uh, you wanna try it? <laughs> I wish everyone at home could see and <laughs> smell how good this smells. I'm gonna try it. I'll give you my honest reaction. Big Better, bite, Jackson. Uh, might be I wanna a know if it has a kick. Cut. Yeah, it's okay. I'm a little scared. All right. I love spicy food, though. Okay. And this is a traditional Asian dish, I'm assuming? Korean, yes. Korean, awesome. Yes. Okay, That's first really bite. Good. Spicy? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it's not terrible. Okay. So would you say like if people it's are good, like... There's a little kick. Oh, okay, it hits <laughs> them later. It is. hits them later. All right. <laughs> well, okay, remind me again, what's this dish? This is our short rib French dip. Okay. It okay. features our short rib with a Gruyere cheese melted over the top. You can try that one. <laughs> I'm going to like, take a second here. That was really good. a little good. minute. All it's right. okay, Jackson. You can try the, the s'mores yeah. dessert later. I'm going to hand you that, Maddie. Okay, thank you. Okay, so how Woo. should people eat this dish? I'm seeing like the, is this like an au jus type of yes, sauce? Yes, it is. Okay, so people are supposed to dip it traditionally. I'm going to yes. go ahead and do my best. Make it look picture perfect. What are the chips? Just regular cut up potatoes? Yes, we <laughs> spiralize our potatoes and trying to parmesan, catch my breath here. parmesan cheese to finish. <laughs> if you like spicy, it's really good. <laughs> <laughs> Never seen you so flustered, Jackson. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's try this one. Mm. Yeah, it's good. I mean, what else can you say? Which one's your favorite? Of if these you had to pick one. dishes? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's a toss up between the putanesca and the shorty French dip. These are great, uh, but if I'm looking for a meal, I'm definitely going for the putanesca with the chicken. Okay. Maddie, should we dig into the meal? I think you should try the dessert since uh, we gave you the spicy food and you're struggling a little. I'm not are you struggling. Gonna, are you gonna, okay. I thought you were going to go for another bite for a second there. I could eat it. I think uh, I think I might need a beer, but it'll be okay. <laughs> try the dessert, Jackson. Okay, let's, let's try this. We're going to end with the dessert. Is there any more desserts or is it just this one that's being added? Uh, just this one was added. A lot. Oh, actually, uh, we added our bread pudding as well. Oh, bread pudding. Nice. Yes. That's a, that's a lot easier on the tongue than uh, <laughs> the Korean steak bites, pork bites, excuse me. <laughs> wow, that's really good. <laughs> oh, Jack, I went from so like funny. one end of the spectrum to the other end of the spectrum <laughs> on my taste buds right there. So I got to like, I don't know, adapt. If you want to put your taste buds to the test, all about kitchen and bar, that's the place to be, I this tell you what. It. Brandon, thank you so much for bringing in these meals. And we're not done talking about the new items that are listed on Nola Bell. So come on, Cato Living, we're about to wake up in style with Nola Bell's espresso martinis and